Hey BFD, it's Crystal. Um, it is actually Friday, so I think I'm supposed to be up today, although it's late, so I don't think that I'll make my day, but, um, anyway, it's Freestyle Week, so that's awesome. I'm stoked about Freestyle Week. I have no idea what I'm going to talk about. Um, <coughs> um, but I think it's good to, to, uh, get a week to get to know who we are. Um, and what we're going through, and, and, um, uh, so, <coughs> for, uh, I do want to give a shout out to Ashton, um, I, I feel for you, I really do, uh, for what you're going through, and, um, uh, I'll send good thoughts your way, and, uh, hopefully things will get better, um, and, <laughs> man, I, uh, I, I feel, I feel bad for you, I really do, um, so, just know that people are thinking about you, and, um, so I, I really, really do hope things get better. Um, <clears throat> you'll have to excuse me, I was really sick today, and I didn't think I was going to make a video, um, actually, until I was watching my, I was updating myself on the BFD video, so, like, oh, I gotta make a video. Um, I get migraines really, really bad, and, uh, today was just, um, no exception to a, a migraine, uh, except that I was just really sick and I couldn't, uh, I couldn't, I couldn't control it. Um, <coughs> and I've had migraines all my life, um, which uh, can can get to a person sometimes um, because they feel as though uh, there's, uh, I don't know, just no control over good days or bad days or whatever, and some. Sometimes friends, you know, think that, uh, so <coughs> not friends, but people in general just kind of, um, it gets old. It really does. It really gets old. Oh, I've got a headache today. Oh, I've got a migraine. Oh, God, another one, another one, another one. Yeah, another one. And uh, I am just as sick of it as, uh, like, if I'm, if I'm dating somebody, um, it's repetitive. It just continues and continues and continues and, um sometimes people that I'm dating uh, just kind of just like oh god here we go again which is understandable because um, I'm the same way I I'm like man I'm getting another migraine another one <coughs> so whew, um, and some people just don't understand how sick I get when I get migraines um, they continue to talk to me and and like pretend that it's just, you know, a headache when it's really not, so, um, yeah. So if you have migraines, I, I, I'm feeling for you. I am, I don't wish that on anybody, I really don't, um, but, uh, yeah. <coughs> so, anyway, now that we've covered the migraine topic, um, yeah, I love you guys on BFD, uh, all your other videos that you make, um, just a shout out to everybody, um, you guys are awesome. Uh, I get a kick out of every one of you guys talking, videos, just the insight that you guys have and the opinions you guys have on um, certain topics are hilarious and uh, and good points as well. So um, yeah, I get a lot out of them and I hope that uh, um, through my boring videos you guys get something. Um, hopefully when I... Uh, get things going. I'll, I should be able to edit my videos a little bit better. Um, right now I can't, so I have to do everything in one take, which uh, sucks. So, um, so yeah, anyway, um, gosh, what else? You know, I've got some, there There are different kinds of people in this world that, um, that, you, that you can be friends with. <coughs> um, there are those friends that talk about doing stuff with you, like, oh, we should go skydiving sometime. Three years later, you've never been skydiving. Okay, not that I want to go skydiving, because I love the ground. I really do. I, Me and the ground are like this. We're tight. We're really tight with each other, let me tell you. Um, <laughs> as if the ground talks to me, but I love being on the ground. Um, and I love flying, too. Um, being in the clouds is another is another thing, but the ground and I are, are much closer together. Um, but 
I have made some really awesome friends uh, in the last year. Actually, I've had some really good friends um, throughout the last three years. Um, and uh, I've been fortunate enough that through my dating this uh, specific person, um, I didn't lose any of my friends. <laughs> um, they stuck with me through all the bull crap that I went through with my ex. Um, who was mentally and verbally and at times I even thought she was going to be physically abusive um, so anybody who is in that relationship in that kind of relationship um, it's not worth it and there's other there is so much better out there for you than to be in something that uh, just degrades your life um, so don't do that to yourself that's not fair to you that really isn't um, but anyway, uh, yeah, I've kept my friends, or my friends kept me, I should say, throughout this two and a half year, um, uh, relationship that I was going through, and, um, I love people who come up with ideas, like, oh, we should go hit the Indian food place next week. Okay, let's go do that. And we do it, and twice, and three times, and... And, um, gosh, I love people who just stick to what they're wanting to do in life and have fun and go out and do things and explore things. And, um, I gotta, I gotta tell you, guys, I am having, um, it's challenging, but I'm having the best time of my life right now. Um, I'm 27 years old and I just got out of a relationship a month ago and, um, I'm really happy. I am so happy that it's just, I can't even explain or, or even put into words um, how awesome this feeling is. And if you guys are in a relationship um, and it's going well for you, that's awesome. If you're not in a relationship, then I hope that you really find out who you are. Find out the things that you really like and don't just settle for anyone uh, when you start dating again. Um, try a whole different um, tactic. Maybe just look for friends, just friends. Don't think about dating anybody and just kind of hang out with people, get to know them. Um, maybe something will develop out of that and then you have a stronghold of, uh, or at least a, a base of uh, a really good friendship and then you start dating somebody. Um, so that's kind of where I'm at. I'm just friends with a bunch of people and uh, I'm not looking to date anybody, but whew, I, I gotta tell you, it's, this is awesome. This time of my life is awesome. Single, being single is not a bad thing. It's uh, a really good thing. Um, so then you, uh, I'm, I'm exploring, uh, spiritual options. Uh, I'm, I've taken a Buddhist class, uh, with a friend of mine once a week, and that is really awesome. Uh, learning meditation, which is kind of hard, <laughs> but, um, yeah, just explore who you are. Do some soul searching and um, just be happy. That's that's my my New Year's resolution this year. Actually, is to be happy and to be healthy. And I'm definitely reaching both of those goals and so much more. Um, so <coughs> yeah. So all right. I think I've babbled long enough. Um, and I hope you guys do well this weekend. Whatever you do, be safe. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I'll talk to you next week. All right, bye.